welcome to another exciting episode of the 360 Daily Show. I'm your host, Adeze Adwaka, and these are the headlines. Kim Kardashian set to produce and feature in a BBC documentary about Elizabeth Taylor. Tommy Fury steps out in an expensive Dior jacket with fiance. Kylie Jenner twins with mini me daughter Stormy. And Leonardo DiCaprio's model girlfriend flashes her abs. And on our trending segment, Kim Kardashian set to produce and feature in a BBC documentary about Elizabeth Taylor. Kim Kardashian is gearing up to produce and feature in an upcoming three-part BBC documentary covering the life of Elizabeth Taylor. The billionaire businesswoman was the last person to interview the late movie star before her death in March 2011. And now, over a decade later, Kim, who has a long idolized Elizabeth, will delve deep into her life for documentary series. The documentary, Elizabeth Taylor, Rebel Superstar, is executive produced by Kim, Carrie Leah, and Hamish Ferguson. It will dive into her early fame, acting career, many marriages, and how she went on to become a billionaire businesswoman, activist, and advocate. Kim Kardashian is excited to be a part of this documentary covering the life of the late Elizabeth Taylor, who died aged 79. And on our spotted segment, a Tommy Fury steps out in an expensive Dior jacket with fiancé. Tommy Fury and Molly May Hag stepped out in the wake of the boxer's hand surgery after a four-year-long health battle. The couple who shared 12-month-old daughter Bambi caught low-key figures in loungewear including a £2,400 Dior oblique down jacket on Tommy as they stepped out in the wake of his surgery. Influencer and Love Island alum Molly May clogged onto her co-star fiancé who she met on 2019's fifth season of the show as they grabbed a bite in a local cafe. And on our new collection, Victoria Beckham travels in style in the coat from her collection. Victoria Beckham proves she travels in style as she touched down at JFK Airport in New York. The Spice Girl put on a leggy display in her leggings and stiletto combo, adding a statement olive green coat from her own collection. A pair of signature dark shades and a Goyard suitcase which an assistant carried completed the jet set ensemble. Victoria has jetted to the Big Apple in time for New York Fashion Week which kicks off on February 9th. The fashion designer can proudly say how once floundering brand is turning a handsome profit. In October last year, the designer told Vogue France her self-titled brand has finally made a profit some 15 years after launching her own fashion label. And on Spicy or Not, Leonardo DiCaprio's model girlfriend flashes her abs. Leonardo DiCaprio's girlfriend, Victoria Serretti, stormed the runway during the La Sculpture's Jack Mars fashion show at Fondation Mar in Paris Saint Paul de Vence. The Italian born model has been dating the movie star since August 2023 after they were spotted going out for ice cream in Santa Barbara. Victoria flashed her washboard abs in a black crop top teamed with skin-tight trousers and a stylish handbag. She oozed confidence as she strut down the pavement in a pair of black patterned stilettos. Victoria was joined by Gigi Hadid on the runway while Kylie Jenner sat in the audience at the star-studded fashion show. Get ready for a dose of fun and entertainment in our daily dish segment. So considering that your business started from something so like generous, I would say, what is the biggest issue or the biggest challenge that you faced trying to be a startup founder for such a program in Nigeria? So it's not my first. It's not your first rodeo. It, yes, <laughs> okay. it's not my first. Um, but I think it's the experience from the first one that mm -hmm. kind of pushed me to this. Obviously. Um, so I started this e-commerce company a couple of years ago, mm -hmm. and we got funding. And it was at the time when e-commerce was just beginning to like play in the markets. Mm -hmm. And um, I lost all my money. <laughs> And we lost all of our money. Oh my God. And then we shut down. We're part of those companies that, you know, go all the way up. And then, you know, they just crash. And then I went into depression. Very sorry to hear that. Yeah. I tried to, like, smile about it. Cause, mm -hmm. um, and when I talk about it, I talk about the fact that I remember staying on my couch for months. 